Alrighty, YouTube. Well, you haven't seen a video in a while. I know I've been getting lazy and not making them a little bit. I'm back in school, but I want to make an update on my Imperial and show you my Camaro as well. So here's the Imperial. As you can see, there's no motor or tranny in it anymore. I just ripped it out because I started doing some new headers. And I think it would look cool in this model, especially the way they come out. I do them headers now with wires and stuff. But this is my Camaro model, 69 Camaro, with a V8 350 in it, custom made for V8 Derby. Got crushed in the rear by the looks of it. See through the rear, you can just barely see. That bumper clogs most of the way there. But that's one of my Chevys I've been working on. The old motor out of this Imperial is right here. We're finishing this one off. This one's done in. I'm starting up on a new motor. I'm going to build this one up. I'm going to take the chrome off soon and I'm going to repaint it. Okay. But, speaking of Chevys, we got this. It's a 64 Chevy Impala custom made for Derby. But I've been doing a lot. I got some welded up plates on the doors to make it look like it was welded. I got a crossbar there going across the hairs. Come out like that. This time I don't have a big square cut out. Here's the car with the padding and stuff. Plus the motor. No uh, radiator yet. I made it so the front end looks up and the rear end's up and in. But it looks good. And then we're doing a mud style now. If you can see on this Camaro how the mud is. It looks a lot better than the old mud. Which is what's on the Imperial. Old mud. What just fell off that Imperial? I have no clue. Probably the hood that was underneath that. That's the hood for it. We have to fix up. But. Unfortunately there was a death. In. My YouTube channel. Uh, there is a death. Suddenly. But. I'll have to make a video on that next. So see you guys later. Bye.